Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Horseman Channel today. Um, today I would like to give you guys an update on what's going on with the car. By the way, if this is your first time tuning in, my name is Daniel, um, and I've had a 2013 Shelby on my channel now for two and a half, almost three years, and unfortunately, very, very bad things happen, but anyways, here is the update. Um, I would let you know, I told you I'd let you know if I went out and bought the car back. So I bought the car back from the insurance company. Here it is in all of its hurt glory. Um, I'm going to be now, uh, basically, I've decided I think I'm going to go ahead and just part her out um, for now because she's just got so much damage, different parts of the car. I mean, hood's one thing, you know, you know this all is, needs to be replaced definitely. Um, but you got the door, you got all around the roof and everything. So, and the different parts of the car, like here, all this, you know what I mean? It's just it, that sign bounced around the car a lot. So, unfortunately, that's kind of where, where it's at. But I definitely wanted to give you guys an update and let you know what's going on. Um, I'm going to actually get it pulled in the garage here. And I'm going to give you guys content on basically selling out the car. And the, the journey now begins on getting the next vehicle. So we are going to sell everything out of the car that we can. And then basically, you know, that'll all go to the fun, funding of the new Shelby. So that's what we'll do. I'm going to keep you posted. Let's get started. Ladies and gentlemen, it is the next day. Um, I was actually going to try to get the car being pulled around and put in the garage uh, on camera, but I didn't have any help. So at the time I just had to get it put in there and go from there, but it's the next day and we're going to go ahead and start <sighs> taking it apart guys. But here we go. So now we've got uh, the, first, the first part to go that I've actually sold on the car are the 1314 taillights here. And they're gonna go to this guy right here. Man, don't make me feel guilty about it. <laughs> I feel He's, bad. He says this is not how he wanted to get them, but it is what it is. So we're now taking them apart. He's going to put them on his Boss 302. Yeah. Uh, the started recording. I already started pulling them out. So. <laughs> <laughs> right. First one. Oh. Oh. Ooh, don't look. Look away. Look away. <laughs> Man. Uh, Man. Dang. Boss 302. Going on the Boss 302. Here that we way, go. when I still got you in your next car, you, oh. you got a memory of it. Okay. Yeah. You know? Okay. Yeah. Yeah. yeah let's, let's live on. You know. <laughs> <laughs> we will go from there. So we're gonna start uh, taking the car apart, obviously, parting it out. If you guys have any parts that you're interested in, that are, as long as they're not already sold, this guy's claiming a lot of them. Yeah. Um, but if they're not already sold, message me on the channel. Um, and we'll go from there and I'll see if I still have them. Like this rear bumper is going to be for sale. The whole yeah, bumper. None of that stuff has been. And that hasn't been claimed. The diffuser, prop, the exhaust tips once I clean them up and everything. Um, and just go from there. So let me know and we'll go from there. We're going to continue getting the car apart and I'll see you soon. All right, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, we've so far, we've got the head unit out. Pretty much the, the screen itself. The Shaker 1000 uh, head unit is all out basically. Tail lights are out. Uh, Jay said he was not. Oh, <laughs> he, he's not enjoying this. I don't enjoy. This is actually more heartbreaking than you think, guys. It actually sucks. Uh, me and him went and picked this car up three years ago in Pennsylvania. We flew all the way to Philly. I know. And drove it back in the snow. It was terrible. It was, but we were determined to get it. We got it. It was amazing. This car has been so wonderful to me, and I've really, it's just been so awesome. Went to an Arizona trip. It's been cross country twice. I just love this car, and it's just so sad this happened because it breaks my heart. But it is what it is. Um, we're going to try to film as much as we can of it coming out and, uh, and just, you know, getting it all the stuff lined out, selling it all, and going from there. Uh, we're going to have quite a bit. 
So the, as you can see here, the hood guys is definitely salvageable. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and it probably I'll list it for about eight hundred bucks. Just kidding. Huh? I'm so oh, kidding. <laughs> um, but you can see here, man, that post when it hit right here, it hit hard. It buckled this whole thing in, and then the other one hit the door, obviously. But it's rough. Let them know we got the motor, the wheels. Yeah, we got motor. GT500 suspension. Yep. Interior's already sold. Yeah, interior sold, seats are sold, but we got the wheels and tires still, and they're all still good. With drag radials. With drag radials. Um, I didn't get this, get this out of the car yet, but the SVT gauge pillar. Gauge pillar, yep. So, we're going to have quite a bit, guys, of stuff for the car. Um, uh, most of it is, so the wheels and tires are available still, the engine is available still, wiring harness in the car is available still. Rear bumper. Rear bumper, the quad tips. Um, the rear valance is available. I gotta, I mean, I'm gonna clean everything up. Uh, but yes, there's still a lot of, on this car that's still available. But yeah, um, deck lid. The spoiler, I think this guy right here is trying to take the spoiler already. Yeah. Um, but yeah, we're gonna have oh, quite Brembo a bit. On the Brembo's on the front. Same for those. Yep. But, uh, we're gonna keep you guys posted. Go from there. Um, yeah, I just wanted to at least give you guys an update. Oh, but now he's gonna go ride the Raptor. So, uh, there we go. Anyways, thank you for watching. Please like, please subscribe. Seriously, guys, subscribe right now. The bell, please, or the subscribe button and the bell. I had like 700 views on the last video, which is not that much compared to most people, but still, I got like four subscribes. Sorry, you guys had to hear that. That was loud. Anyways, um, yes, yeah, so I had like four or five uh, subscribes and like 700 views. If you're watching it, please hit the subscribe. I promise I'm going to keep content coming and go from there. Love you guys. Thanks for watching. As always, what's in your stables? And this one is uh, not going to be here much longer, but we'll go from there. Thanks for watching. I'll catch you on the next video.